I'm James Magna, it's 6 o'clock and uh, I'm on my way to footy. I get up at 5.30 every day. I hate traffic and I'd rather get in at uh, 6.30, quarter to 7 and you know, have a nice bath or go to the players lounge and have a bit of a snooze. Getting in early is not too bad for me. We're just coming up to probably going past Eastling. I worked on that for two and a half years from start to finish pretty much. So. It's a friendly reminder every morning to work my butt off to stay uh, in the footy world or else I'll be back there. Yeah, to get drafted it just was hard work. I've been working really hard since since I was 16, 17 and I always sort of prided myself on working the hardest at any club I was at as far as uh, fitness and, and doing extra stuff and I reckon that's sort of that's helped me. You don't really find too many people that have taken shortcuts getting too far in, in footy. My parents were yeah, they were always on my back to just keep at it. Yeah, well the first NUB Cup we played Brisbane and Gold Coast and I think first bounce I lined up on Simon Black and in the second game I played on Gary Abbott so I followed him ever since I was a little kid and yeah it just felt it didn't feel real. Do you reckon you're just a bit too deep with your starting position here as well? Yeah, I suppose that's where I was You've kept the space thinking up. about not trying to get too close and then worry like that. And that's where you've yeah, you've just got to be able to impact yeah. on Judd there. The biggest motivation would be just trying to, to be a successful player in the AFL environment. I've seen a lot of players, mates and stuff over the years come in and come out and not really have an impact on, on their club or or really do anything. They just come in and they're happy enough to be an AFL player. So I want to come in and I want to make a little bit of a difference to the Melbourne Football Club. That's that's my real motivation at the moment. I love playing AFL. It's a dream job. It's better than digging holes or sitting in an excavator, definitely. So anyone that tells anyone otherwise is kidding themselves.